Hi guys, welcome to our CA final SCMP self-paced paper. We are doing a chapter of strategic performance measures in private sector. Now, our aim of doing all these MCQ videos is basically to tell you that there is a certain way to be thinking of the answer. There is a logic behind each and everything. Whether ICA has given that logic or not, we are trying to explain with all the illustrations that are possible. These, these videos will be of great use provided whenever you are seeing the videos, whenever I ask you all to comment at that time, please comment the correct answer as per you and slightly better if you have done the relevant chapter before you try to see the MCQs of that. So let's do these. The number of inpatient hospital deaths decreased from 8% from 776 in 2021 to 715 in 2022. If you will find 776 to 715, you can compute it on a calcium approximately will be coming to 8%. Now, one small thing, those people who don't know, there are two kinds of patients in every hospital. One of them are inpatients, other of them are outpatients. Inpatients doesn't mean the patient is going in and outpatient, the patient is going out. It's not like that. Inpatients means those patients who get admitted to the hospital, stay over there for a few days till the time they are recovered or they all go uh, to God forever. Outpatients are basically those uh, patients who only take the consultation, the OPD services. Okay, they only take the consultation from the doctor, the medicine and they leave. They all don't get admitted. Okay, so therefore the number of inpatients deaths decreased from this to this. Okay, give me the four options first. Economic, social, environmental and need not be reported. Actually, a stupid question by the institute. Are at least right what we have to be doing here? So actually, this question is all about triple bottom line. Okay, they should have mentioned this thing that this information will get reported under which of the three areas. You must be knowing this thing, but then I'm giving you all time answer. So therefore, this question is all about triple bottom line where there are three P's. You have planet, you have people and you all have profit. So this information will get reported where that is whatever you have to be answering. So this is the time. Answer it, please. Okay, so now triple bottom line was made by a gentleman called as John Elkington. And I really think that this guy requires more amount of recognition because most of the new... Uh, reporting platforms that will be coming will be all based upon triple bottom line only. You have something called as GRI, Global Reporting uh, Initiatives. You have something called as Integrated Reporting. Now, all of them are basically based upon this only, whereby we start to be thinking. All the reports that we present are not only for the shareholders. They are there for all the stakeholders. And today, every company is not working in isolation. Every company works for profit for sure. But then every company is part of the society. They should always try to report what those guys have done for the people. Lastly, they are surviving on this planet Earth. They should also try to, re to be reporting that what they all have done to save the environment. Example, Apple reports each and every year how much lesser plastic those guys have used, what those guys have done for the environment. Example, uh, Samsung around in 2023, for the first time, they all reported that we are using the plastic which gets dissolved in the oceans and we are using that plastic to be making the phones. Apple from the year 2020, I think, from the time iPhone 10 had come, they all stopped, stopped to be giving the chargers. And at that time, Tim Cook had told that this is how we are trying to contribute towards the environment because everybody has a charger. Why, why to give another charger? Apart from that, if we do not supply the chargers, boxes also become smaller. We are trying to be saving the paper in that. So John Elkington was one of the first people who told that every company should try to report their activities that they have done in the last year under three heads beta people, profit and planet. Profit, you all know, that is whatever happens in your paper one, that is financial reporting. That is, you all try to be reporting the financial data. But is financial data really enough these days? Many profitable companies up in past have not survived today. Companies like Nokia, companies like your General Motors at that time, it is becoming so difficult. Okay. Why? Because might be they did not talk of the other two aspects of the business also. The other two aspects in this case, what has a company done for the people? People will mean general society at large. It could mean the customers. It could mean uh, the employees. It could mean suppliers also or anything that concerns the people. Lastly, what has a company done for the planet, for the environment as such? 
if a business is profitable if a business takes care of the people if a business takes care of the planet then seen middle a business is always going to be sustainable that is whatever triple bottom line says so therefore as far as this question goes the number of inpatient deaths decreased from this to this now this has to be reported now this has to be reported under which it is concerned with your customers you are a hospital it is concerned with your customers so therefore this should be reported under people criteria okay so therefore answer should be b over here that is the correct answer. I'll see you all next time with another MCQ. Bye. Take care.